welcome back friends uh, in this class we are going to discuss about a very important future of jquery so just you need to go here or just uh, leave this like this you can just remove this area and here also you can say add class and you can say add class comma remove class remove class and toggle class so this is the title how we can add a class how we can remove class and how we can toggle the class toggle class means uh, you can remove and you can add with just only one single click so inside uh, the css uh, for right now we have just only one img tag uh, there is nothing else so we are just uh, going to remove this because we don't need this and here inside this we are going to create a class equal sign double quotation you are giving the name di double v1 so for d1 uh, you are just coming here inside the css or you need to just uh, paste here you can say dot di double v1 and you can remove this style tag from here and you can save uh, go to run menu launch in chrome so we have a div here and uh, 800 pixel is the width 300 pixel is the height uh, background orange text color uh, green and text align center and we have a button here and now we are going to create another div inside the css just to locate this i am just saying this div2 this should be div2 uh, the same width 800 pixel width height should be the same background should be blue and uh, text color should be something like yellow font size text line center you can say box shadow box dash shadow like uh, 4 pixel again 4 pixel and 20 pixel the color should be gray you can save now just focus here we have uh, add uh, this class inside uh, the style tag not inside the body tag inside the body tag we have only one class it's called div1 so we have add another class another new class inside the style tag now we are going to add a class how we are going to learn how we can add a class so just come inside the script tag uh, insert a dollar sign round bracket again dot again round bracket and semicolon inside the single quotation at first we are going to select the button so for button we have bu double t1 dot button one so when someone click on this button c-l-i-c-k i-c-k so you want the result uh, for just getting result so you need to run the function function round bracket open then curly braces again inside this insert the basic syntax semicolon here inside this single quotation you are uh, just selecting the div which you have created inside the body tag this one div1 so you are just coming here dot di double v1 so we have selected the div and you are just saying here add class add class and inside this you are going to insert a single quotation uh, inside uh, this uh, parenthesis and you are just saying here there should be div2 div2 control s uh, we have uh, by default we have one class inside the body tag you can see here this called div1 and we have added another class by the name of div2 inside the css now we are going to add uh, the div2 on the div1 it means you are going to overwrite come here refresh click on this not working let's check dot add class div2 
so you must give here double v same spelling div2 save and come back refresh and check now you can see we have a box shadow here the background color is changed the text color is changed so you can see once again click here it is working it means you can add a class on another class so like this you can add another class also here control d this time you can give the name for this div3 same width the background color should be red test color yellow form size should be just like this uh, we are just giving shadow 10 pixel 10 pixel by 10 pixel control s now here you are going to use div3 it means you are going to add uh, div3 or uh, add a class uh, on, uh, on the div1 you are going to add uh, div3 class on the div1 class save this refresh click on this so you can see this is a new class you can see the shadow we have increased the shadow text color yellow background color red so it was about uh, add a class so we have learned how we can add a class now we are going to remove a class if you want to remove a class so just right here remove class make sure uh, the c first letter c uh, should be written in capital so here you are uh, just going to tell which class you are going to remove for example you have div1 you want to remove div1 or you have div3 for example i am just going to say remove div1 control s refresh click here so you can see the div1 is removed it means you can remove all the formatting so there is so you can see we have given for div1 width height background orange text color font size text line so you have just removed all the formatting just by doing one single click here so you can see remove it has just removed so after this we have toggle class so instead of this you can write here t o w g l e toggle class so you can add here something like div3 div2 anything control s refresh you can see add remove add remove add and remove so like this uh, you can add a class you can remove a class you can toggle a class so in this class we have learned about these three how you can add class how you can remove class how you can toggle class so i hope uh, this video will be helpful for you you have learned something from this video and uh, just watch all the videos once again i'm going to tell you again and again do practice have a nice time and see you